Jeff Seidel. I'm here in front of the Western Wall in Jerusalem, and I'm excited to tell everybody that our student centers at Hebrew University, Tel Aviv University, IDC, and also in, in Beersheba at the Ben Gurion University are proud to join this week's Shabbos project, which was initiated in South Africa. This week, Parsha Noah, October 24th and 25th, our student centers will be partnering up with the Shabbos project, which was initiated in South Africa last year by the chief rabbi, Rabbi Dr. Warren Goldstein. Once again, we're very excited. Our student centers will be partnering up and participating in this unique project, uh, which was initiated in South Africa. Hi, I'm Atlee Chang. I'm Lindsay Sergan. I'm Lonnie Fink. And we're here in Prairie, Israel. And so happy to be part of the Shabbat project. Shabbat, and it was really a beautiful and um, inspiring experience for a lot of us. And we felt so welcome to the people's home. And this week for the Shabbat Project, I'm going to be spending it with my group, my Kutsa, in Akko, in our house. And we're going to be having really nice dinner, and great discussions, and really looking forward to it. Hi, it's Rufi and Shmuel from the Jeff Seidel Jewish Student Center at Tel Aviv University. This Shabbat, we're going to be keeping it together with our Tel Aviv University students and tens of thousands of Jews around the world. for the Shabbat Project. I'm a student at the IDC, Go Psych, 2016 class, RIS, and I hope you guys are with me and with Alicia. Shabbat Project 2014, keep it, and God bless Jeff Seidel. Love you, man. <laughs> Hi, we are Rabbi Masan and Kai Weisberg, directors of our very Schuster's Women's Heritage House in Old City of Jerusalem. The Heritage House is a non-profit youth hospital for Jewish families. Shabbat looks forward to us and many women who are coming to Jerusalem for taking the Shabbos project. We hope this initiative, which was led by Rabbi Goldstein from South Africa and was so successful, will have a great impact worldwide. The Heritage House is keeping it together with Jeff Sandy House and the Student Center here in the Old City. Hi, I'm Leah from Tel Aviv University and I'm excited for the Shabbat project and spending Shabbat with Shmuel and Murphy from the Jeff Seidel Student. Hi, I'm Sarah. Hi, I'm Anna. Hi, I'm Casey. And we're from the Jeff St. L. Student Center at Hebrew University. We are so excited to be a part of the Shabbos Project. I can't wait to have you go to Shabbat with everybody. Let's, Let's keep, keep it together! together. Hi, my name is Chesky Hawking from the Jeff Seidel Student Center here in Herzliya. This year, we will be participating in the Shabbos Project on October 24th and 25th. We will be hosting a challah baking on Thursday night, Shabbos prayers, and meals, followed up by a musical Havdalah. Jeff Seidel Student Center, keeping it together, for Talia. I'm Seidel Zettel. When I'm on duty, I work for Jeff Seidel in the Student Center in Herzliya. We are helping partake in the Shabbat project this week. Um, in Herzliya, we're going to be doing challah baking Thursday night, hosting Friday Shabbat meals. Lots of soldiers are actually partaking in the Shabbat project. In different communities are taking part. It was successful last year in South Africa, so hopefully this year I'll be successful in the whole wide world in uh, keeping the Shabbat together. <laughs> Uh, I'm Jack Podolsky. I'm very excited to be uh, participating in the uh, Global Shabbos Project this Saturday uh, here at the Jeff Seidel Student Center. Uh, growing up, I didn't really uh, do Shabbat um, in the traditional way, but since I've been in Israel, uh, I've been observing it, and it's been really a pretty amazing experience to put down the smartphone and not go on Facebook and stuff and really uh, enjoy the moment, and I'm really looking forward to sharing this with uh, thousands of people worldwide here in Jerusalem. Hi, my name is Zach Frankel. I'm from Long Island, New York, and I'm here at Hebrew University, and I'm really excited to be a part of the Shabbos Project this coming week here at the Jeff Seidel Student Center. And I've been keeping Shabbos my whole life, but I know this is going to be a really special weekend for all those people who haven't had a chance 
to experience it. And there's no better place than Yerushalayim. Hey, it's Yaakov Kessler. I'm here at the Student Center. I'm working with Jeff Seidel, director of the Student Center over here. And I'm super excited to be uh, part of this Shabbos project. And we're having tons of students coming over. And I'm very excited about it. And we hope it to be amazing. Hi, South Africa. I'm a big hello to my old high school from David Linksfield. I'm Cassie Giva, and I'm speaking to you from my apartment at the Hebrew University of Jerusalem in Israel. And I just wanted to say that I and my friends from all around the world, as well as Jeff Sandel, are all keeping the Shabbos project together. I'm so proud of you guys. Hi, I'm Danielle, and I run the Jeff Seidel Center here in Ben Gurion University in Beersheba, and we are very excited to be participating in the Shabbos project, keeping it together. We're going to start this week off with a Shabbos and sushi shir, and we're going to come together. And while we expand our minds and learn about Shabbat and what is it, why is it, how do we keep it, we're also going to be expanding our stomachs with sushi. <laughs>